I'm Sandy Wyckoff, and I own the Chatham Clothing Bar and Chatham Kids. And I thought it would be a good thing if we checked in for the Chatham State of Mind. And we're just going to start with Mary Cavanaugh, who is the Executive Director of the Chatham Chamber of Commerce. Hi, Mary. Hey, Sandy. How are you? Good, good. It's great to see you this today. I know, I know, even though it's cold and rainy and kind of ugly out. But I wanted to check in and see what was going on with the chamber. And are you open? Are you conducting business? What, what are you doing down there? Well, we are uh, working remotely, um, but still checking phones and answering emails. Um, we are a staff of only three, but we're mighty. Um, we have our operations manager, Danita, um, and a marketing associate uh, by the name of Rebecca, and myself. And we've um, been very busy uh, updating our website, um, chathaminfo.com, um, pushing out uh, social media posts on Facebook and Instagram, um, and uh, working on emails that we uh, communicate to our members multiple times a week with hopefully helpful information for them to navigate um, this crazy time that we're going through. Are you getting a lot of phone calls? Are there inquiries coming in? What's happening with people calling the chamber? Because that's one of the statistics that everybody always pays a lot of attention to. What's yeah. happening with that? We are getting phone calls. Um, they are calls, of course, related to COVID-19. Um, but uh, before we started this interview, I was just returning a call to a woman from Wisconsin who was asking about the former twin lighthouses in Chatham, and did one of those lighthouses go to um, Nauset? And so I was reaching out to um, Danielle Jeanlo from the Atwood Museum, and she forwarded me a bunch of information, and I forwarded along to this uh, person from Wisconsin. So, you know, we're still getting calls like that, um, and we are getting uh, some calls and emails relating to COVID-19 as well. I noticed one of the very first things that happened um, was we got a really great e-blast from the chamber about all of the different restaurants that were open. It was so concise. It was so great. It was so easy. What, what prompted that? Were the restaurants Actually, saying they need help or was that something the chamber initiated? What happened there? That was great. That was a collaboration between the town, um, Shauna Neely, who's the administrative um, assistant to our town manager, Jill Goldsmith. She um, reached out to me and said, Mary, we're getting calls about who's open for takeout. Um, can you do something? Can you put something together? And, and so we said, sure, and just gathered um, as much information as we could at the time. And, and that list is, is constantly evolving and changing. Um, so we always tell people to check um, independent, you know, each individual's uh, or restaurant's website to be sure. But yeah, so it, it came from um, from Shauna, who's the admin for our, our town manager. Oh, I like that. I yeah. Were the restaurants really responsive when you called them? Had they decided what they were going to do or did it push them into making a decision? Um, I think it was a little bit of both. Um, I know at first some restaurants were going to be closed and then a couple days later after they saw how it was going with other restaurants, I think they decided, okay, I, th I think we can do this. We can try this. And there was a little bit of, um, I, don't, I, don't, I don't know if I want to say fear, but maybe anxiety about how it was all going to come together. Um, but it's, it's worked out really well, I think, I hope. Well, at least it has for me. I've gotten takeout from, I think, almost every restaurant in Chatham. I love it. It's great. I'm like, I'm not going to use what's great. Or I'm going to get takeout. I'll wait till I really have to use what's in my freezer. Yeah, that's if great. If there's anything about the chamber that you wanted to say or reach out, what would that be? Just that we're here. Um, you know, we're, like I said, we're posting um, a lot of emails through Constant Contact. Um, with a lot of information, um, want people to know that 
you know, if you're not finding what you're looking for, or if you have a very specific question, um, don't hesitate to email me, um, mary at chatminfo.com, or you can call the main number and leave a message. And I'm checking those on a daily basis, and that's 508 945 5199. Um, so please don't hesitate, and I will try and get the answer that you're looking for. That's great. It was so nice to talk to you today. Nice to see you. I never see anybody anymore. It's great. <laughs> Good to talk to you too. And thanks for doing this. I think this is great. Oh, I think it's going to be a lot of fun. Take care, Mary. <laughs> you too.